It's absolutely valuable for your users to understand when was the last time your report get refreshed. Don't miss this tutorial to learn how to create last refresh date and time field in your Power BI report. Hello everyone, Shaab is here with another interesting Power BI video. It is highly possible that your users need to see when the last time your reports get refreshed. Stay tuned up to the end of this video and I will teach you all you need step by step. Don't forget to like and share this video and subscribe to the channel to get notification for the new upcoming videos. As always, you can be in touch with me through my LinkedIn, Twitter and Instagram and read Power BI articles on my blog. Let's dive in. Consider we have a Power BI report like this one, and you set a schedule to refresh its data, or maybe you refresh it on demand. But your customer is not sure when was the last refresh date and time and so they are not confident that they can trust on your report. Also, sometimes there is a problem in refreshing your report based on your schedule, and then you can immediately realize the issue when you cannot see any changes in refresh date and time info. So, what can we do? Correct, we can create the refresh date and time field and use it in our report to show our users when was the last time this report get refreshed? But how to do it? What we are going to do is going to Power Query Editor and from New Source, choose a blank query. Then in this box here, write equal to datetime.localnow, open and close parentheses, and then hit the check. Then I am going to change this query name to data refresh. Now we have the current date and time, and now I am gonna convert it to a table. So from here, I press to table button and boom, you can see the data in columnar format. I just renamed the column to date time. And then what I'm going to do is duplicate the date time column and name the column as date. And then I'm going to the transform tab and from date and time column section, choose date and then date only. And then again, duplicate the date time column and rename it to time. And then this time, I'm going to the transform tab and from date and time column section, choose time and then time only. Now we have a table here, which gets refreshed whenever we refresh the model. Let's close and apply. To test, I'm going to create a card and drag the date time into it and format the visual. You can see here the last date and time the report gets refreshed. And now if I press on refresh the whole model, and wait some seconds to complete the refresh process, you can see the date time get updated. Just notice that if you refresh only one table in your model, this refresh time will not get updated. For example, here, if I refresh the team product table by right clicking on this table, and choosing the refresh data, you can see the refresh date time information didn't change. This happened because I updated an individual table, not the whole model. So the date and time info only get refreshed when you refresh the whole model. And if you are refreshing your report in Power BI service, there isn't any problem as you are refreshing the whole model. So easy peasy. Just a quick way to see the last refresh time on your report. I'm curious to know what's your thoughts. Comment below this video. And like and share this video and subscribe to the channel to get notification for the new upcoming videos.
be in touch through my LinkedIn, Twitter, and Instagram, and read Power BI articles on my blog. Have a good day, all Power BI lovers.